I just heard from one of my clients who said, Amy, can you help me? How do I support my partner who's dealing with some depression? So here I am. If you're dealing with a partner with some depression, know that you're not alone. I'm here to help. You're in the right place. I'm Amy Culler. I'm known as the best intimacy coach because I offer real solutions for real people because therapy can't address everything. Not everything can just be talked about. For example, depression. I have the research in my book extensively that talks about how talking doesn't help. Whether you're the one talking or listening to trauma or depression, it has a negative effect on the function of your brain. So what are you supposed to do? Subscribe, hit the notification bell and stay with me because I've got methods, real solutions. I have a move called the huddle. It's a hack that I discovered and developed that helps you feel intimately connected with yourself and your partner. It is a simple act that expresses your emotions. I believe that depression comes from a lack of expression. You can't express whatever it is. There aren't words for it. You can't talk about your feelings and you can't talk about these feelings, which are touch feelings also. So whether you're a physical partner, a person who expresses themselves physically or emotionally, depression is just that inability to express yourself. It shuts you down. Mm -hmm. That mm-hmm, that's a huddle sound. Mm-hmm. That mm-hmm is a pulse. It's a positive pulse. And when you're making this sound, it has a positive effect on your brain, brain function, just like talking about depression or talking about trauma has a negative effect on your brain function. Huddling, making that mm-hmm sound has a positive effect on your brain function and on your respiratory system and your heart function. It regulates your whole body, okay? Humming also activates the vagus nerve. Maybe you've heard about that. It's called vagal toning. And that's what tells your body that you're okay. These sounds also tell your body what you're feeling. Oh, ouch. These are huddle sounds. These little sounds speak for you. They express your feelings and your emotions without words. Do you want to help your partner with their depression? Don't talk about it. Don't say to them, what are you thinking? What are you feeling? Because really they can't express it. And if they start going on and it turns into this flood, you're under this flood, it's a negative emotion, a negative for both of you. What you can do is to be with them, willing to connect in any mood by using this huddle. It's a physical expression that expresses your emotions and it allows you to release that tension off of your nervous system. So instead of going and ruminating on it, spinning these cycles of negative thoughts over and over, you're able to release them with just... <laughs> so get with your partner and your goal is to get them to huddle. If they're in my program or doing this work with you, then they're familiar with making that sounds together. It's vulnerable. That's why it's good to do with your partner because it creates the connection that you can feel. And that's what heals. There's research that says that the cure for depression, anxiety, and addiction is the connection that you can feel. And, that, and that's what heals. This huddle creates the love connection. So you're sitting with your partner and instead of them, and you know what it's like when somebody, they just have these pricklies coming off of them. But if you can sit with them and go, oh, and get them to just go, oh, 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 and express it, just keep letting it out. Even if you have a whole conversation like that, which I would get partners to do in my office, it feels so good. You feel so expressed. And when you're making those sounds, you get this breathing. Uh huh. And that's what regulates your system. And that's what connects you with your partner. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. I'd love to know if that makes sense for you. If you found that this was helpful, leave me a note in the comments. Let me know. Let me know if you have any questions or if you found this helpful. And make sure that you hit that like button. 
make sure that you have subscribed and hit the notification bell, okay? And if you need help in your intimate relationship, dealing with your partner's moods, getting in the moods, getting connected, you don't have to figure it out. I'm here to help. I've got a program called the Intimacy Game Plan that helps you go from roommates to playmates without just talking. Mm -hmm. You'll find a link in the description that'll take you directly to my calendar where you can talk to me. I'll give you a strategy, give you some moves. We'll discover if the intimacy game plan, if being part of my program is right for you. You don't have to figure this out alone. I'm here to help. In the meantime, stay connected to yourself, each other, and me, and I'll see you soon. Sound good? Mm-hmm.